All right, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Um, the prayer is that, um, yes, it says, loving our husbands and children and serving those nearest to them. Um, so the prayer is for us to pray that there'll be a loving relationship in our marriages and that, and with the children that we will love one another and that uh, we will serve uh, our neighbors who is everyone we come in contact with Amen. Uh, so um father almighty god we want Amen. to Thank you for what you've done, oh God, Thank and you. for everything you have spoken, you have downloaded today regarding Titus chapter 2. Father, based on that, we are praying, oh God, that with the pressures of this season that it will not affect our homes it will not affect our families that we will love one another that will be loving our home we will honor our husbands and that they will love us because that's you know according to the word of god and that there will be a loving um relationship within the home so that that will, it will be a haven for for every everyone in the family to thrive in father we thank you for what you're doing right now oh god that our children they are inheritance of the lord they are taught of the lord great shall be their peace father we are declaring peace over our children we are declaring their head not detailed they are above only and not beneath and we are praying that the light of god is in them that they will shine brighter and brighter and they will affect not only those in their sphere of influence but as they go out they'll show forth the prayer praises of the almighty God that is our father in the name of Jesus and that they will honor their mother and father that they'll be uh, their, their days will be long father that thou, we will not be alive burying children because they have fallen in that area in the mighty name of Jesus Christ Amen. Father, we thank you, Lord. We thank you for provision. We thank you for all that is needed, oh God, everything pertaining to life and godliness, oh God, that will bring warmth in the home, oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we Amen. thank you. For what you're doing in marriages right now oh god we are praying oh god that this time that we've been locked in uh, by the system but we've not been locked out by the lord that it is actually building a, a priest in in every home in every street in in every area father many have come to to know christ more intimately as a result just as what happened in china when there was persecution but the christ the the, the people of god we are increasing by the day and therefore we know lord that we are building up more godly homes as a result of this lockdown we thank you for the goodness that came out of this we know lord that because of it oh god love is flowing, <coughs> flowing in our homes oh god in the mighty name of jesus there is no more stress because we are not now getting to know each other more than we ever know them as a result of the business of life father we thank you and we pray for those mothers who have been stay at home mothers and i believe that they have sown greatly for the next generation there is no mother that is um idle 
it can never happen because even the prayer, the hoping, nourishing the, uh, the, the children and building legacies that will see them from generation to generation. I thank God for stay at home moms and I thank God for those who made it and, and something of their own jobs because we will start building from Jerusalem to outside and I want to thank those mothers and I pray oh God that we will have more mothers because I pray for my children I say your wife's gonna be at home for some time to take care of their children because there is legacy when we invest in those in our family and i thank god that our families are getting stronger in christ and as we are building up we will build out we begin to shine from home to 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 the uh, outside to influence those that is within and outside our influences thank you father for the love thank you for the compassion that is reaching through in our homes thank you father for the understanding that is coming through you at this time father we bless you because our children right now they are stronger in the lord they have known who they are who they are right now because we are able to fellowship more than ever thank you father for the family thank you for the gift of the family thank you for the investment of Oh God, that you have made, that you even have to adopt all of us, that none of us are fatherless. Father, we bless you, oh God, and we pray that our children will not feel that, you know, any, um, any loophole that we have, Father, because you will make it up for them. Father, we just pray, oh God, that families will be so strong these days, oh God, that nothing can penetrate, not even the, reg the, the laws of the land because Lord your law supersedes every law we bless your God for our homes we thank you Lord that father we are seeing yes. the will of God happen in this generation amen amen, amen. 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 amen.